Hey, what's up guys, Zaid here. So today we're not gonna be going into Muay Thai, sadly. I was planning on going into Muay Thai, but something came up and unfortunately I won't be able to. So we do have some time a little bit earlier today to start off the week and start off session one of week two of Toroti uh, Olympic lifting program. Also, we're gonna be running four miles today. We're gonna be altering the pace a little bit more to see how that goes. So it will end up being a little bit of a heavier cardio day towards the end because Muay Thai is very cardio intensive very very cardio intensive especially since Tuesday since sparring night and it will also give me an extra week to get back into the rhythm of Muay Thai because if I'm going into sparring with some of these uh, savages <laughs> which they, a lot of these guys are there some of these guys fight professionally that's that's what they uh, do like to do is have my cardio set because that's something that I can trust I know I have an above average cardio so I can definitely rely on that and my hands are heavier my hands are way heavier than they were prior to uh, this past December so me going in right now I definitely felt the difference in my hands of how heavy they were and how heavy my legs were in comparison to last year and it's because of all the Oli all the Oli has been has been getting me thicker <laughs> you know in all the right places but it does affect you in in sparring so it's starting to rain now uh, but yeah by the way if you guys didn't see yesterday's video I'll leave a link to it up here or a card that way you can guys go ahead and check it out I know I posted it super late and I uploaded the wrong one I uploaded today's uh, the video the day prior to that so now I'm just gonna leave the right one up here that way you can guys go ahead and check that training out that way if you guys are following the training because I am posting every single one of the uh, to male 2.0 uh, series like I'm posting every single one of these workouts as I go, so if you guys want to follow along, it'll be perfect. We're going straight into Oli right now and then finishing off with some running.
four miles in had to push on that last one felt good i'm tired for sure but that was a brutal workout both the snatch and doing anything here in the running on the track um obviously i didn't have enough time to rest in between and this time i forgot my little glucose dispenser to go ahead and help out with both of the workouts but we should be good we should survive but yeah so we started off with snatching down there and everything was from the blocks so it was very interesting so from the blocks 50 60 65 percent all the way up to 70 and then from there we started moving in to snatch pulls from the blocks and again from 70 to 80 to 90 percent of my one rep max for my snatch then we went into back squat the back squat was killer to finish the workout and 50 60 70 percent of my one rep max on my back squat and then um, sot press so basically being on like a snatch position out at the bottom of the squat and then pushing on that snatch position that's basically a sot squat uh sot snatch squat <laughs> so yeah i think that's how you pronounce it and then just went ahead and finished off with four miles three of those miles were uh, again relatively chill pace it didn't feel super chill because of the workout that i've done prior to so i was definitely pushing my heart rate definitely was showing me on this last mile i went ahead and i pushed i remembered something that i used to do back in the day especially when i carried a lot of muscle that i've forgotten for some reason and whenever i do have a lot more muscle on my body i tend to give a lot smaller steps as opposed to longer steps and that usually helps me out with my tempo it helps me out with my pacing so i end up doing 100 in 80 to 185 steps per minute, which is a lot, but it helps me keep up better pace. I get less tired and over time, my heart rate will slow down. I know it'll look like it's gonna go crazy for the first miles, first couple of miles, but in the future, it'll definitely be better. So it's just working towards it. It's the same as putting in very small miles and then slowly working up to faster miles, same thing. So last mile was indicative of that. I was able to do um, a lot more steps. It felt a lot easier to go into that eight minutes and 30 seconds mile um, than ever before. So done with today. I'm gonna be posting this up as soon as I get home. Zade out, give this one a shot. It's gonna cook you guys. Eesh.